someone from our floor will call you just to check up. Marcio Torre is getting ready to leave UW Medical Center after five days. He was recovering from surgery, where tumors were removed from his colon and liver. I think my body's better off now than it was five, six months ago. Back in 2013, Marcio first noticed rectal bleeding, but ignored it, thinking it was a hemorrhoid. He was 43 at the time and had no family history of cancer. And then it got progressively worse. This family photo was taken a month before he was diagnosed. Stage four colon cancer and prostate cancer. I never thought this was gonna happen to me, you know. I think cancer was my biggest fear. It's here, I have two. Two aggressive forms, not just one. Doctors have been treating it with chemo and surgery. He's been fighting it with his family's support and has many milestones he wants to achieve with them. Watching them get married, help them in the selection process for college, you know, helping them with, with school and education. And I'd love to be a grandfather one day. The thing is, you don't hear about people under 50 getting colon cancer. I am seeing increasingly people that are now in their 20s to 30s and actually have a couple people who are in their teens. Dr. Mukta Crane says research is being done to figure out why this is happening. And there's no definitive genetic abnormality that we're seeing. And in fact, the amount of increase that we're seeing in a relatively short period of time kind of weighs against this being genetic, but potentially something environmental. But we don't know what that is in our environment, unfortunately. That's why Marcio wants to share his story, especially because he's a physician himself. Listen to your body. It's communicating something to you. Don't ignore and dismiss it. Because catching it early is key. You know, I don't view colon cancer as a death sentence. I think it's treatable where we are today in 2019. There's hope, and I'm here to communicate that there is hope. From the UW Medicine Newsroom in Seattle, I'm Kitty Chen.